All right, so the inspiration behind uh, this um, model was just my phone, <laughs> just what was sitting in front of me when I read the assignment. Um, so I decided that it would be, you know, something that fit my kind of beginning skill level and something that um, was interesting to make. So yeah, decided to walk you through the process. All right, so uh, Maya is not for some reason won't let me screen record in it, so we're gonna have to do this, um, I guess. Um, so I took a cube, uh, modeled it to be uh, in the shape of a phone, um, and then I used the uh, bevel tool um, to, let's see, I wanna make sure I have the right tool. Um, yeah, the bevel tool uh, to uh, make it kinda round selected the uh, edges um, kind of on like the top edges um, to make it uh, more round uh, and thin like a phone is and then I made another cube slightly larger uh, to be the phone case and I did the bevel tool made it have like less edges so it was more geometric looking more like a phone case um, and then I create some edges right where my mouse is right here uh, create some edges um, kind of where the end of the screen is uh, and then push those down so kind of more of a phone case look and not just another uh, slightly larger phone then the buttons on the side I just made smaller cubes uh, made them in rectangles and pushed them in so it was slightly sticking out of the side of the phone um, so that they look like buttons. I then UV mapped uh, each uh, object and then I assigned each object a color. Um, they were the same colors. The buttons were white, the case was red, and then the screen was uh, black. And I assigned colors so they'd be easier to use in Substance Painter. Alright, so um, to texture the model, uh, I just kind of Started with the, let's see if I can get it, yeah, okay. Started with the phone case and um, gave it, no, I'm sorry, the phone itself, gave it a, uh, kind of like a, what's it called? I think it was, um, like a glass uh, mirror type thing. And that that worked it well um, for, to get it kind of reflective on the top. Um, and then I uh, used just a carbon fiber um, uh, texture for the uh, phone case. Um, gave a cool look to it. And uh, yeah, and I turned the uh, like metallic, uh, whatever that is, like the metallic glossiness um, all the way down. Um, and then for the buttons, I did carbon fiber as well but I made them a little bit darker um, so they stick out a bit more um, so yeah that's how I textured the phone 